Hello everyone and welcome back to another tutorial. In today's tutorial we're going to be covering the Cannabis Plus 3.0. For Cannabis Plus 3.0 they've added some new items. Before you get started I'd suggest you get together all the items. Get some glass houses or a shovel so you've got somewhere to grow. You'll need a car battery, a vacuum bagger, a shrink wrapper, plastic wrap, some empty ounce bags, 10 planks, a box of nails, and you'll need a hatchet to cut down the wooden log. You also need garden lime and some cannabis seeds. Growing of your wee plants hasn't changed, so all you need to do is fertilize, plant, and water. So once the weed has grown, you just look at the base of it and gather the raw plant. You'll see it will fall down to your feet as a raw plant. And now what we need to do is dry it. So to do this, all you need to do is harvest a log and then you can combine it with a rope to make a drying post. Then you pick up the drying post kit and choose your placement. Just like with everything else in Daisy, you'll see a hologram appear where the placement could be. Once you've decided where you're putting it, you just hold the left mouse button and wait for the animation to finish. The drying post has six different hanging parts and this is where you can put your raw plant. You just grab it from your inventory and simply hold the left mouse button and drag it to the places. Don't forget to walk up to the pole and scroll through the mouse wheel and select leave to dry. Once they're dried you just need to wait and you'll see the buds will come into this area here. Now what you need to do is you take 10 planks and 20 nails and scroll through until make workbench kit. You'll see a cardboard box will appear at your feet. So you take the box to your hands and then simply place the workbench where you'd like it. Again you can see the hologram up here. And then you just hold the mouse the left mouse button and wait for the animation to finish. Now you have the workbench. This is where you place the battery, the bagger, and the wrapper. You can buy these items at the black market. Now you can see uh, that there's other places here too. So you can put the plastic wrap and the empty ounce bags. And this is where you need to put the buds. What you need to do is you need to put 32 buds for every brick. So you can see the ones that are dry already have appeared on the drying post. Once you have those you can just place them on here until you have 32. If you put your workbench close enough to the drying post, you can simply just move them from the drying post directly to the bagging area. You've got your 32. You make sure you have you make sure you have some bags in here too. You can stack up to 160. And then what you do is you just tap F if you want to pause production, tap F again. When it is on, as you can see, the workbench automatically starts producing the bags for you. If you want to stop the process, just hold the left mouse button and that allows you to interact with it. So if you want to restart it again, just tap F and to stop it, remember you hold 
the left mouse button and you'll see that it started again. Once it's produced 16 baggies and you have plastic wrap in the workbench, it will actually wrap the brick for you. Just like that, you have a brick of weed. So all of the actual bagging process um, from the bud through to the brick is all done by the workbench. Thanks for watching. Good luck growing. Yeah. <laughs>